Every surveyor is defined by how they overcome challenges. On paper, a job may not seem to pose any difficulty, but reality has proven otherwise. It just seems impossible to prepare for everything. So you just plan for the worst and hope for the best. But if the worst means you drove all morning, committed to an exhausting hike down a gorge, without a network signal, or the ability to set up a base station, you better have something up your sleeve. Or like I did, have a G16 unit around to help you out of a jam. It blew my mind when I first tried a GS16 with a smart link feature and was able to get corrections in the most difficult scenarios. It definitely took a weight off my shoulders when I was able to get my measurements done that day. For surveyors, nature can pose many different obstacles like tree canopies, mountains, ridges and canyons. But there are no obstacles more challenging than man-made ones. Take for example tunnels and bridges or even urban canyons that often pose the most challenging environments. You will be exposed to large structures that block satellites and tall glass and steel buildings that cause signal bounds. More than that, cities are alive lots of movements from pedestrians, cars zooming past, and buses driving by. All this adds to the interference of the signal and tricks your typical antenna into picking up false ones. So I was really impressed when the GS16 was able to overcome this with its self-learning feature. At the end of the day, None of these great features really matter if the human element is ignored. But with a new Captivate, it becomes about surveying again, rather than button pushing.